this problem we have an object that has a mass of 10 kilograms and it's hanging from two ropes at different angles. And we want to find what the tension in each of those ropes are. So if we just take 10 kilograms times the acceleration due to gravity of 9.8 meters per second per second, we get 98 newtons as the weight. So what we're going to do to solve for tension is, is we're going to break each of the tensions into x and y components, and then we're going to see how they all cancel out. So the tension on the rope that's going at 30 degrees is broken down into x and y and it's in blue. The tension of the 45 degree rope is broken down and it's in red. Then we have a green arrow for the weight of the object. Being that this is a statics problem, everything equals zero because there's no movement. The x forces or cosines of the tension equals zero because they cancel each other out as seen in the diagram. So tension one cosine of 30 minus tension two cosine of 45 equals zero. And if we look in the y direction, the two tension forces going in the y direction minus the 89 newtons equals zero. Or tension one sine 30 plus tension two sine 45 minus 89 newtons equals zero. If you don't understand why I'm using sine cosine, review Sokotoa. So now I took the first equation with the cosines and I made T1 on one side and everything else on the other side by doing basic algebra. So now we take what we just found T1 to be equal to and we plug that into the second equation. Then we solve for T2. Should T2 do equal 87.86 newtons? So now if you want to find T1, you can just plug in the T2 into either of the equations and solve for T1. So for T1, we get 71.74 newtons. Hope this video helped. Thanks for watching.